day, everyone! Today, we're going to conduct an experiment which are Siphon and Archimedes. But first of all, we will give you a brief overview about Siphon and Archimedes School. Let's start with Siphon. What is a Siphon? How does it work? A siphon is a long bent pipe that is used to transfer liquid from a reservoir at a higher elevation to another reservoir at a lower level when the two reservoirs are separated by a hill or high level ground. A siphon must have a longer outlet leg below the short leg inlet elevation to allow the weight of the liquid in the longer leg to create suction which causes the siphon liquid to flow down out the siphon end. This has a greater volume of liquid in the long leg than it has in the short leg. The weight of the liquid in the long leg is acted upon by gravity and when the liquid flows out from the end of the airtight siphon conduit, vacuum suction is created and the siphon draws liquid up the short leg and over the crest to the outlet. Lastly, Archimedes screw. The Archimedes screw also known as water screw or screw pump. Water pump by turning a screw shape surface inside a pipe. Also used for materials such as powders and grains. Further, Archimedes screw could produce power if they are driven by flowing fluid instead of lifting fluid. Although commonly attributed to Greek mathematician Archimedes, there is some evidence that the device has been in ancient Egypt long before his time. Archimedes' screw is formed a positive display dis displacement pump. Its pumping traps the fluid from a source and then forces the fluid to move to a discharge location. Now, let's proceed to the materials needed and the procedures to follow. Flexible tube Tupperware Scissor Packaging tape PVC tube Fill the container with water Fill the tube with water. Cover both ends of the tube. Submerge the tube in the container. Lift the other end of the tube and place it in the Tupperware. Make sure the other end of the tube remains at the very bottom of the container. Wrap the flexible tube around the PVC tube and apply packaging tape. Rotate the other end of the tube over the topperware with water. Make sure the other end of the tube is facing the empty topperware.